It's an event that attracts thousands of people from across the country each year. I'm talking, of course, about the Lexington Barbecue Festival. From kettle corn to sandwiches to barbecue trays, the festival has it all. Just ask Jonathan Jones, who made the long journey from California. I haven't really had like real barbecue in forever, so it's kind of nice to actually taste it and get the real taste of it. But Jones says it was his family that pushed him to attend. Uh, my mom and my stepfather told me about it. They know I like to eat food, so they're like, well, you should come here. Here in Lexington, people may come for the barbecue, but they stay for so much more. Jim Quick and Coastline was one of the more popular bands to hit the stage, so popular that Burlington native Marie Barber mainly came for the music. I love to listen to the bands. We just listened to Jim Quick. It was fantastic. We go to eat barbecue, and then we go into another band. They have bands all over the place. Cameron Dudley, the lead drummer for Jim Quick and the Coastline, is a 1993 Elon grad. He says students pursuing a career in music should try to get as much experience as possible. Just, just play. You got to get out and play different styles of music with different folks, and uh, you know, get your name out. The Lexington Barbecue Festival also held several attractions for a younger audience, including animal races. Four times go pot belly to grace them. Brent Cook has made coming to the festival a priority so he can continue his family's Hogway Speedway legacy. We've been coming to the barbecue festival for probably over 10 years now or more. I've lost count. We've been working for a while. The thing that keeps him coming back is... You know, the fans, the crowd, we always have great crowds, and of course we're racing pigs at a barbecue festival. Couldn't get any better. But for one kid, the barbecue festival had nothing to do with food, music, or even pig races. What, why do you like the trains? Because I like them because, because when I watch them, they're Thomas. But if you ask me, it still comes down to the food. Brian Anderson, Multimedia News Production.